How you guys doing over here? Today is Sunday, December 9th, 2018. Beautiful morning up here in Gilpin County, Colorado. Temperatures in the low 30s probably and slight breeze blowing. Sunshine shining, so pretty nice day. We had a little light snow this morning. Woke up to just a dusting of fresh snow on top, so yeah, man. Maybe soon I'll be able to do a little snow skating out here, see what happens. Maybe I might try to do a little bit if we get a little more snow this winter. But yeah, actually it's been a pretty, well it's not technically winter yet, but so far I'd say we're a little below average on snowfall. And temperatures haven't been too bad. So, so far been barely average for the winter weather, but you know, things can change real quick anyways yeah other than that man, things are going pretty good man it's out here taking dingo for a hike this morning did some housework this morning go to town do a little shopping maybe have a beer at the bar and come home and get ready for another week's work yeah fucking work man it's always a challenge right Especially now I'm working on a, on a job now where I'm having to deal with a fucking asshole, man. You know, there's like one guy in this fucking company that I work for who's like the biggest asshole. Everybody talks shit about him because he's an asshole, you know. So, yeah, he was kind of being a dick to me on Friday. You know, I'm like, God, I was like so tempted just to tell him to go fuck himself and fucking not, and quit, you know. So tempting to me right now, man. You know, because, you know, I'm just... I'm at a point in my life where I'm just fucking tired of fucking, you know, I just, I don't like taking shit off people, man, you know? And I'm just like, you know, I really don't need your fucking shit, dude. And, you know, maybe all these other guys will take your bullshit because they're fucking so, you know, they need this job that bad. But you know what? I'll find another job, man. I'll survive. I don't need it, man. But I probably regret it if I did that. But it's really tempting just to tell this guy what I really fucking think of him and just walk off the job. You start being a dick to me, you know. It's going to be hard for me not to, but, you know, I think I might regret if I do that. I'm, I'm sure he's going to be, he's going to continue his shitty attitude towards, like he does towards everybody. When things don't go his way, he acts like a child, throws a fucking tantrum, starts cussing. You know, and, I'm, and I really don't like being around people like that, you know. I really would rather not be around such a fucking negative attitude, you know. Things, things don't always go fucking perfect in this world, man. It doesn't mean you fucking have to fucking cry like a little child and fucking tr and abuse everybody else around you. Hold on a second. Some people here. It's just Jason and his pack of doggies. What's up, baby? What's up, baby? How you doing? <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> it's a pack. That's a They're a nice, friendly pack of dogs. I mean, they, they've been walking up here as long as I have. That guy Jason and his pack of dogs, but... But yeah, you know, it just sucks. That's, that's just the way the world has to be, man. No matter fucking... Every fucking job is like that, man. There's always gonna be some fucking... Some bullshit you gotta fucking put up with, you know? Because you fucking have to make a living. Because you have to fucking have a wage slave position because you need the fucking debt notes. You need the fucking, you know, the, the digits in your fucking account to keep the fucking, the fucking evil wolves at bay that always want their money every fucking month, you know? <laughs> so it's just the way it is, but man, it's sucking, it sucks. That fucking, you know, people that are psychos like that, you know, they, they tend to fucking, take control of situations and like the guy that owns the company just lets him do it because he's thinking that having this guy as his watchdog on the job keeps his guys in line you know that he's got this fucking asshole that fucking treats everybody like shit all the time is gonna make his guys work harder well fact is man it doesn't fucking work pushing people around you know being abusive to them treating people like shit it really doesn't fucking make them work harder man it just makes them fucking hate your guts no, but some people just don't care, man. It's just the way they are. They're fucking, they're big fucking babies. You know, they act like they're big, tough motherfuckers, but 
Once you stand up to them and put them in their place, they fucking, they back down like little bitches, man. It's exactly what he would do if I stood up to him. And you know what? He keeps fucking with me. That's just gonna happen, man. I'm only gonna take so much of his shit. But I will for a while. I'll just keep my mouth shut. Not be nice to him. Just fucking, you know, do my job while I'm there. No joking around. No fun. Don't laugh at his jokes. He, he, he jokes with me. I just fucking roll my eyes at him. Because I don't, you know, you're not going to be my friend one minute and turn around and fucking abuse me the next minute when things aren't going your fucking way. So anyways, yeah, it's just the way the world is, man. There's always got to be a fucking dickheads out there to make your life fucking miserable. Try to anyways. But you know, it's just a way, it's just a way of dealing with people, man, you know? If you don't, if you, if you want someone to do something differently, you don't, you don't fucking attack them with an attitude. Say, no, don't do that. You know, yell them like they're, like they're your fucking daddy. Like you're yelling at your child, you know, especially. No one treats me like their fucking child. When you do it again, dude, I'm going to tell you to fuck off and I'm going to walk. Because, you know, it's just, you just don't treat people that way, man. I mean, it happens all the time, man. People put up with it, but not me, man. I'm not gonna fucking take it off this fucking turn, man. I'll tell him exactly what the fuck I think of him. He keeps pushing me around. Anyways, yeah, man, you don't fucking... It's, that's the wrong way to approach people. It's the wrong tone. You don't talk to me, you know? Like, people don't, you know... I just want to tell him, dude, you can't fucking talk to me like that, okay? Because next time he does, that's what I'm gonna tell him. You can't fucking talk to me like that, man. I'm not... You're, you're not my dad, okay? My, my dad don't even talk to me like that, all right? And he's not even alive anymore, but... But anyways, yeah, you can't talk to me like that. And, you know, there's the, the, the ways to approach people, you know, like, hey, you know, I, I, you, you're, doing, you're not doing that the right way. And let me just show you, you know, I'm not trying to be an asshole here. I just, this is the way I'd rather you have you see you do it, you know, if you can do it like this, I'd really appreciate, you know, you know, you not to be that nice, but instead of being a fucking total, complete negative dickhead about it, you know, and abusing somebody because they're not doing something the way you want them to. That's all I'm saying. I'm just saying, man, you know what I mean? You know, it's all about the tone, man. You come at somebody with a tone that's negative and, you know, and just abusive, you know, you're not gonna get a good result from people. You know, and it's just a lot of people, that's the way that they run things. Instead of being, you know, tactful and, you know, polite about it, they have to be an asshole and abuse people. And there's just too much of that in this fucking world, man. Because people are under so much pressure and shit, and then psychopaths are in control. But seriously, you know, I'd rather, I'd rather be unemployed for a little while and find another job than work under a fucking tyrant, you know, that, that fucking makes, you know, makes my workplace uncomfortable every day, you know? Fuck that shit, dude. And then I come home and I'm in a shitty mood all the time because I'm dealing with some fucking dick at work who fucking abuses me. I'm not gonna do it, man, so... That's how I'm going to have to fucking deal with the situation.